In this video, we're going to take a look at the choice feature under Add an Activity. Uh, a better way to think of choice is poll. Uh, all it really does is uh, allow you to set up a poll for your students. Um, you could use this uh, as an advanced organizer or a bell ringer. Uh, you could use this uh, as a way to vote for something. Um, you could use this um, as a way to just get a discussion going. Uh, it's a really neat feature. It's easy to use. Uh, we'll take a look at it now. Uh, I already have my editing turned on here. I'm going to go down to Add an Activity, and I'm going to go to Choice. I'm going to name the choice. Um, and in this HTML, HTML editor, I'm going to put um, the question I'm going to actually ask. So I might ask something like, What is your favorite color? Now in here, I just put the uh, options. So on and so forth. Now up here I can limit uh, the number of choices that can be uh, given in this. I'm just going to leave that as disable. I'll scroll down to the bottom. If I need to add more fields, I can click here to uh, um, to provide more options uh, for answers. I can set up a time in which this can be answered, say in the first 10 minutes of class or what have you. In the display, I can display the options uh, vertically or horizontally. Uh, the results I can publish um, after the student's answer. Um, always, so on and so forth. So again, if you're using this in class, um, your students will have laptops. Um, they'll come into class, they'll answer this question, and you'll be able to use it right then uh, for your for your lesson that day. Uh, you can allow it to be updated um, and show a column for unanswered. So if nobody answered that, then it would still have a column for that. Uh, here's your basic group settings. I'm going to go ahead and save and return to course. As a teacher, if I click on this, uh, this is what I'm going to see. I'll see there's no responses uh, yet, and it's displaying the options right here. If I am a student, let's go ahead and switch that role real quick. All I'll see is uh, the options right here. And once I answer it, it'll indicate the answer that I gave. So again, uh, choice, a uh, better way to think of it is, is, is a poll. It just sets up a very simple poll very quickly uh, for your students to use.